this is Liz. Welcome to my channel. For today's video, I thought I would share with you seven items, not bags, luxury items that were purchased in 2021 that I think are a great investment. Now, I did another video where I talked about all of the handbags that I purchased in 2021, and that was so much fun. Please check that video out if you haven't already. That was so much fun for me to film that I said, what else would I highly recommend that I purchased in 2021? So here are the ones that I came up with let's get started now if this is your type of content if you love this sort of video if you love fashion a little bit of luxury and some lifestyle don't forget to hit that ring bell notification so you could be notified every single time I upload which is on Sundays and Wednesdays and don't forget to subscribe it helps me so much grow my channel the first item I want to talk about and I highly recommend was my first first experience with a Zimmerman dress this beautiful dress here i have worn for my birthday i felt so beautiful now if you watch my channel you know that i love zara zara is so affordable and for me purchasing a zimmerman dress was a dream right i said that's way too expensive i will never invest that much but i looked at this dress it comes in different shapes it comes longer it comes looser but this was the shape for me this one is called cassie i believe that's the name it is a linen blend i love all of this loop details the colors are breathtaking beautiful romantic i felt like a princess on my birthday everywhere i went someone had to talk about the dress was it zimmerman you know it was just so eye-catching i felt like a princess on my birthday i went to miami for my birthday weekend and we had brunch at the swan their heads were turning everyone was wanting to know is that a zimmerman dress so it's definitely eye-catching and the quality is amazing I loved wearing this dress. I would definitely again purchase a Zimmerman dress. This was my very first purchase and it won't be my last. Now, if you like this dress, I was browsing on net -Port and now they are 50% off. I know, that's sad when that happens, but I guess Zimmerman does go on sale and this one currently is 50% off. Now, I had a little few issues with the sizing. This is a size zero. I did purchase a double zero at first, but it was too, too snug around my rib area. So if you are similar frame to me, 5'2", about 100 pounds, this might be the way for you to go. I'm gonna insert some pictures so you can see me on my birthday. I put my hair up in a bun because I wanted the dress to be the statement piece and I paired it with my Chanel boy bag and I truly, truly felt amazing wearing this dress and I would definitely purchase another Zimmerman dress. It is just breathtaking. You feel so beautiful when you're wearing it and the quality is amazing. Since then, this one has been dry cleaned and it came back just as beautiful as it went in, but cleaner, of course. So that's my first piece that I recommend. Dip your toe in Zimmerman dresses. I know they are an investment, but you do feel and look amazing while wearing them. <music> Item number two of luxury purchases from 2021 is this beautiful necklace. It comes in this little box here with the whole string and it is retailing for $470. This is the Louis Vuitton Essential Necklace. It is in the gold tone. You can definitely adjust it to your preference. There are a few rings to make it longer or shorter. I love it at the length that I have it right now. I just feel this is a timeless piece that just wearing a bodysuit like I have on today, a button down blouse or a t-shirt, you look super chic and I don't think you will regret this purchase. It is so beautiful and every time I catch a glimpse of myself in the mirror, I think oh, I'm so glad I picked that up. It is very, very beautiful and chic looking and that is always carried by Louis Vuitton in part of their essential jewelry collection item number three that was purchased in 2021 that i highly highly recommend especially if you are a mini bag lover like me i love a mini bag all day long there's something so cute about them okay the item that i'm speaking of is this louis vuitton wallet now it's in the rose ballerine and the monogram 
canvas. Oh, I have my little gym card here sticking out in the back. I thought I emptied it out so I can give you full display. I'm gonna open it up so you can see. The name of this wallet, I don't wanna tell you the wrong thing, is the Zoe wallet. So when you open her up, oh, I actually left my stuff in there. You have five card slots, two on this side, two on this side, the one in the back that I keep my little gym card in, and then you have an area for cash, which is always nice for those of you who still carry cash, a little area for coins over here. It is a super compact wallet that fits in all of my mini bags. And I used to be a card, a card holder lover, one of those little card holders that doesn't have an area for dollar bills or an area for coins. But ever since finding this wallet, I no longer use a card holder because I feel this is the same thing, but elevated. You have more options with this wallet and you don't have to worry about where's your cash gonna go? Do I have to fold it up into a small little rectangle? It fits nicely the way cash is supposed to fit in this slot right here. So this is the perfect compact wallet. I am so happy I picked this one up. I, knew, I know that they do offer it in this like fuchsia color with the same monogram. And then they also offer it in other prints. But I am very satisfied and I highly, highly recommend this wallet if you're looking for a small, compact wallet and an upgrade from a card holder. Definitely a go. Item number four of items that I picked up in 2021, luxury items that I recommend. Okay, it's going to be this beautiful, I believe the color is vintage blanc, which basically I feel is like a creamy color with a tiny, tiny bit of gray. It's this beautiful belt here. Now, what I love about this belt is that it looks super chic with a pair of white jeans on, but also just as beautiful with a dress on. I have a lot of summer dresses and I cinch my waist with this. It is the gold hardware. I'm very interested in picking up the black one. The black one comes in the gold hardware as well as the silver hardware. So if you're more into silver, if you like that look more, this is a size 70 and I am able to put it on my hips and also on my waist. I love the fit of it. This was after having so many, like I had like three Gucci belts, I needed something different, something a little bit more discreet and I found that this one here fit the bill. I recommend it, it's very discreet. It's nothing that's screaming logo, but still you have a touch of luxury when you're wearing this item and I highly recommend this one. It comes smaller, like I said, mine is a 70, but it also comes as small as a 65 and it comes in many, many colors. Okay, we're up to number five of luxury items I recommend. Now, last year, I started looking at all my shoes and starting to think, what am I gonna get the most wear out of? What do I wanna invest my money in? And I thought of, I live in Puerto Rico, it's warm here all year, but mostly white color items, clothing, shoes are mostly reserved for spring and summer, but still, we can even push it a little further. And I thought, how about some luxury flats, right? You don't have to worry that they're gonna hurt your feet, you're gonna be in pain walking around, you can pair this with jeans, you can pair it with a dress, and I came up with these beautiful Fendi slides. These are woven slides. If you look closely, it's kind of like a wicker fabric with the little Fs in black. These also came in other colors, more of a beige color, and they are currently on sale. So if you're interested in this shoe, Netta Porter has them on sale. I also saw them at Farfetch on sale, but they are super comfortable. I have traveled with these on. So you look so luxurious put together and you're wearing comfortable shoes with a little pop of luxury. Again, super discreet. Only if somebody's really, really staring at you will they know these are Fendi. I've paired them with white jeans and a white t-shirt. I've paired them with a black dress, so these are sticking out. And I've also paired them, of course, with a white dress. I think I have some clips, so I'll try to include some clips of me wearing this with a white dress, but I have definitely enjoyed this these sandals and I feel like I've gotten my money's worth which is so important when purchasing a luxury item back when I purchased these 
These were priced at $6.90 and I believe they have come down since maybe even up to 50%, but they were worth every penny because like I said, I've worn them with black dresses, with white dresses, I've worn them with white jeans, with regular nude color jeans, and there's a bird that wants to be in my video. <laughs> So I have definitely gotten my money's worth out of these and I highly recommend them. They don't pinch. They're comfortable. The heel is very, very small so you can walk a ton and not feel uncomfortable. Definitely a thumbs up. Item number six is this beautiful piece of makeup that I picked up in 2021 and I have slowly become the biggest fan ever since I have repurchased and what I'm talking about is this Gucci mascara now I originally ordered this one from the Gucci website but currently I have repurchased and you can buy them in Sephora now this is not an outlandish price I believe this is $35 which is the typical price for a Lancome mascara if you're picking up a mascara from chanel that is the going rate now what i find unique about this mascara if you check out the brush it is very very thin and what it does that i really really enjoy is that it takes all of your lashes and it combs them and it brings them to their full length which makes your lashes look so long miles miles long the difference is I feel it's more of an everyday look because it doesn't make your eyelashes look, for lack of a better word, chubby. They're going to be skinny and long. Now, if you want chubby eyelashes, you can layer them, I guess. But this simply combs them out, makes them look super mild long and more of an everyday look. Not super glamorous, more everyday, I would say last and final item is again another makeup piece considered luxury because it's from chanel makeup chanel beauty and it is a foundation that i have purchased again and again so not only in 2021 in 2020 2019 2018 i've purchased it again and again um since it was available and it is this Chanel Velvet Makeup. Now, like I said before, I live in Puerto Rico. Our skin tends to be dewier than other places in the world. So for my skin type, I definitely need, I think my skin type is more normal and can be a little oily in my T-zone. I highly, highly recommend this Chanel foundation. It is the velvet one. Like I said, it is more of a matte foundation, but it truly makes you look airbrushed it has this blurring effect i have more pores in this area here and it does something very very pretty where it makes you look softer a little bit more blurred and definitely i reserve this makeup for when i'm recording i also reserve this makeup for a date night or where i'm gonna try to bring my best and this makeup is been made for the past few years i believe it's been revamped and I will continue to purchase this makeup again and again because I do love the finish. I love how it makes me feel. If you're curious, my color is beige 40. And the price for this foundation, it's currently going for $50. But like I said, I have a CC cream that I wear on the everyday, but when I'm recording, when I have to go somewhere for a meeting, or when I'm going out for a date night, this is the foundation that I use and I truly, truly recommend it. If you have similar skin type to me, I would say try it, go for a sample before you make the investment of the $50, get yourself color matched, try the sample from the department stores and purchase it or get at your sample because it really, really makes a big difference. It is beautiful makeup. If you've come this far in my video, thank you so much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed going through seven items that I purchased in 2021 that are considered luxury items that I have truly enjoyed. And because you're my friend, I recommend them all to you. Don't forget, leave me a comment, give me a thumbs up, and don't forget to subscribe. As always, thank you so much for spending a little bit of your precious time with me.